Greetings, one and all. Welcome back to NHL 19 Be A Pro Mode with Liam Kirk. Yes, we are back here again to start the 18-19 hockey season with the British hockey phenom, Liam Kirk. Now, last episode, we were with the Arizona Coyotes and we played through the preseason before the 18-19 NHL season. And even though we managed to tie the team for second place in points, I believe we had three goals and one assist for four points in six or seven preseason games. Even though we managed to tie for second place on the team in points, we were demoted to the Tuscan Roadrunners of the AHL. Of course, the Arizona Coyotes AHL affiliate team. So after having a brilliant preseason and really making a case to stay on the roster, we didn't have the job done and the Arizona Coyotes management decided that we should have some seasoning in the American League. Now, whilst we should technically be going to the Peterborough Peets in the Ontario Hockey League, because that's where Liam Kirk is actually playing this season, I'm actually quite glad that we're going to Tuscan and here's why. If we were sent to the Peterborough Peets, then we wouldn't be able to come back to the NHL for the entirety of the season. We'd have to spend the rest of the year with the OHL try and come back next season. However, now that we've been uh, demoted to the Tuscan Roadrunners, there is still a very high chance that if we play well this season, or to start this season, we can be called up to the Arizona Coyotes roster. Maybe even by the end of this video if we play well enough. So, things are looking really good. We just need to take this opportunity as it comes. Don't see this as a negative experience. See this as a positive. If we play, if we play well enough, then we'll have the chance to go back up. So Kirk is playing on the third offensive line, just like he was in Arizona. Second power play unit and the first penalty killing unit. So the left wing playmaker from England has got a lot of responsibility on his head with this team to try and make sure that they do well. So let's start the 18-19 AHL regular season with the San Diego Gulls, the Anaheim Ducks affiliate team, visiting the Tuscan Roadrunners on October 6th, 2018. Let's do this. So you know how we do this, guys. We'll play the third period of the first, third, and fifth games of this episode. Simulate the entirety of the second and fourth games. And simulate the first and second periods of games one, three, and five also. So, first game of the season. The home opener for the Tuscan Roadrunners. Let's see how they do. First period. Okay, so one nothing lead to San Diego. Blandishi scores on Hill. However, nine shots to eight in favour of Tuscan. Second period. Okay, it's a 2 0 lead for San Diego as Walinski scores on Hill. However, 21 shots to 18 in favour of Tuscan. So let's get in this. We've got 74 offence, 77 defence, and 74 goaltending. San Diego clearly a much better team. 76 offence, better offence, 82 defence. That's incredibly solid. Much better defence and much better goaltending than us. So they are a much better team. The problem with the Coyotes is most of their prospects are already on the NHL roster. So. Very interesting. And what I did notice is the uh, Roadrunners are in their white jerseys for home. I assume that's an AHL thing. White jerseys at home, coloured jerseys away. I don't quite understand that. Why would you want to? Why would home fans want to see their team play in white jerseys for the entirety of the season or for every single home game? I don't get it. Surely you'd think that the, the way the NHL does it, because they used to do white jerseys at home, every single team has a white jersey for, for away. So there's no personality there if, if every single home team is using a white jersey at home. Maybe that's just me. Anyway, let's get into this game. So, first shift. Let's do this. How much longer we got? So, 90 seconds in. That's pretty pretty consistent with preseason as well. Liam Kirk, number 64, is ready to go. Out on the ice he goes. Good. Blandishi, good hit, Liam Kirk. Good hit, son. It's a very solid hit. Okay, try and, try and get that puck. No worries. Just get one. You got it, coach. I'll try my best. Okay, good block there, boys. Good block. Number 16, you go. I'll cover number 73. Okay, he passes it to Blandishi instead. Well, I've, got to, I've got to stay on my side of the ice. I keep forgetting that I'm a left winger. Got to stay on my man. Stay on my man. Oh, this is my man by the looks of it. Good poke check to me. Lovely pass. Right, Kirk, he's out the zone. Good to Dorfin. To me. Ah, oh, tried to pass it. Oh, ow, I'm knocked down, but I'm back up. He gets knocked down, but he gets back up. Good back check there. We'll take a line change. We're running out of energy. That's a good first shift. C pluses all around for Liam Kirk. Good job, Kirky. So 17.40 left in the game. Our next shift will be at 16.10. Okay. We just need to get one here, Roadrunners. Get one and we're back on the board here. Good take by Dorfin. Clears the puck into the zone. Nice play. Bickle to Saborin. Oh, good play on the forecheck, son. To me. To Kirky. Oh, I tried. I pressed the pass button game. Okay, and I've fallen over this guy. Can we, come on, Kirk. Let's get up, son. Get up. Get out of my way, defenseman. Okay, good save by the goalie. Right, 15.47 left in this period. 
Had 20 seconds on my shift so far. Not the best shift here. I did press the pass button to try and send it cross crease. But it looks like it didn't happen, so fair enough. Okay, tried the face-off win there. I'm trying to get to my man. Try That's my man. What are you double covering him for? Okay, just cover my man. That's all I've got to do. Cover my man. Good. Good play, boys. Good. Dorfin, send it up. Send it up, boy. Oh, that's going to be an icing. That's going to be an icing. My bad. My bad. I mean, he did send it a little bit too far for my reach. But it's not really an excuse. I did call for that pass. Sorry, Dorfin. Sorry, dude. Right, another face-off. 15.32 left. I'm going to crash this face-off. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Oh, I tried to block that. Not happening. Okay, let, let him take the face-off. We'll take a line change. Why is that a bad line change? Why, why is the... Why did I just lose 10 experience for a bad line change? There was just a stoppage of play. Surely that's the best time to take a line change. Good face-off win there. Time up. Good pass out there. Hugh Linker. Good. To me. To Kirky. Oh, the shot's blocked. Oh, that was a good, good set of defensive coverage there by, by the uh, Gulls D-man. We've got to score an RAHL debut, folks. We've got to do it. Got to skate to the bench. Skate to the bench. How is that a bad line change? Is it because I'm in the defensive zone? So, C plus C plus C. Okay, so I've lost a bit of team play because of these bad line changes. No worries. 13.41 left in the first... Third period, I should say. First period. I don't play first periods in this series. You guys know that. Apparently, I don't. Right, let's go, guys. Here we go. Ah, oh, that's a bad play. Hit him. Oh, good hit. See, I'm working really, really well on the forecheck. I'm using the body to create chances on the forecheck. I'm really, really scared of making poke checks because I don't want to take penalties. Oh, no. Oh, that's a good poke check, though. Made a good one there. Oh, keep the puck out. Good. Kirk, Kirk, go on. Hustle over. Hustle over. Good play. Back to the defense. Set up something here. Good. Good. Bank pass. To me. To me. Okay, just try and send that on goal. Send that on goal. Get the face off. We weren't able to set anything up there. They were covering us very well. But we managed to get the face off here. So I either crash the net. Yeah, I'm going to crash the net here. going to crash the net. Gonna crash the net. Gonna crash the net. Gonna cr oh, you get hit off the play. Come on, defense. Skate to the bench. Okay, good line change. Okay, I've, I've, I'm now starting to get some good line changes in here. So C plus C plus C still. Good poke check going on there. I'm, I'm getting my defensive stats sorted. I just need to score a goal. We need to break the shutout. Need to score on my debut if I want to go back to Arizona. So 824 left in the third period. Come on, get Kirky back out. Lovely. Let's go, boys. Okay, you tried to go one on three there. Not a good idea. Good hit there, Kirky. Okay, careful, boys. Hults. This is my man. I've got to cover him. Oh, good block there, lads. Good block. Okay, covering my man. Covering my man. Okay, maybe not. Oh, and there you go. I knew there was going to be something there. Tripping penalty. My bad, boys. This team play stat is really going down. Guy, you, you pressed the right bumper once. Okay, so it looks like they've killed off the penalty. Sorry, boys. Sorry, coach. I do apologize for that. Okay. Get, okay, what's happening here? I'm on the penalty kill unit, so I don't know why they want me to skate to the bench. Here we go. Here we go. Low pad rebound. Good. Oh, you can't get the goal. Right, skate to the bench. Good line change. Thank you, coach. I'm trying to make up for some, some of those bad line changes. So C plus, C plus, C minus. Getting some good poke checks in there. Getting some bad poke checks in there. Oh, that's a long simulation. That's probably till the end of the game, isn't it? Yep, and the San Diego Gulls win 3 nothing. As the Tuscan Roadrunners are shut out in game one of the season. Liam Kirk can't score in his debut for the AHL team. Which is a real disappointment. C plus, C plus, C minus for us. That's not the best. It's not the best at all. So discipline has obviously brought us down. Physical stats. I feel like we made some good body checks there. So I feel like we should have gained a little bit more on that. Defense and puck skills and shooting. We lost more experience than we actually gained. But that's because of the penalty. Didn't really get any shots on goal because my players wouldn't get me the puck in the offensive zone in a good position. And I couldn't break into the zone very well because um, I wasn't getting any support. But, you know, what can you do? It's game one. It's game one of a long season. Let's see what happens. So let's go on to game two. Game two is against the San Diego Gulls, but it's a home and home. So literally like the next weekend, we go to take a look. So in-game performance, minus 69. That's <laughs> 69. Minus 69 experience there. So not the best start for Liam Kirk there in his debut. It doesn't matter. We've got game two against San Diego. Let's give it a go, boys. So let's simulate through this game. Cousins against Terry for the opening face-off of game two. First period. Okay, it is a 1-0 lead to San Diego. DeLeo scores on Hill. 14 shots to 11 in favour of the hometown Gulls. I was about to say Dulls. I was like, what? Second period. 
Okay, wow. The Tuscan Roadrunners managed to get two on the board. Richardson and Nick Cousins score on Boyle to make it a 2-1 game. 27 shots to 18, though, in favour of San Diego. And third period, a 4-2 victory. Maggio and Dave Boland score. Holt scores one for San Diego, but it's Tuscan that take the victory. Let's take a look at the stats, see if Kirk got anything on the board. Uh, where is he? He's right down here. Nope, nothing on the board. Two shots. Okay, so Liam Kirk's still looking for his first point in the AHL. He's got the Bakersfield Condors to try and get that against. So, we're home once again. Oh, no, we're away. Sorry, I thought we were home. We're, we're away. Let's see if we can do this. Richardson against Downing for the opening face-off. First period. Okay, no score after the first. Eight shots apiece. A very even period. Second period. Okay, it's a, th a 2 nothing. I was going to say 3 nothing. It's a 2 nothing lead to Bakersfield as a Pole and Hamilton score on Langhammer. 17 shots to 15 in favour of Bakersfield. So they have worse offence. They have better defence. And their goaltending's awful. God, this has got to be our chance, fellas. This has got to be our chance to pot some goals. Liam Kirk, you're going to get your first goal in your third game in the AHL. I feel it. I feel it, boy. I think you're ready for this. Let's do this. Liam Kirk, he's ready. Just need to get ourselves on the board and get ourselves some positive experience here in the AHL. Okay, let's do this. So, CCC, playmaker, generate offense through creative passing plays. I'll try my best, coach. I'll try my best indeed. I mean, I can't guarantee it with the players that we've got on the roster, but I will try my best. So, about 90 seconds into the third period. Makes sense. Let's get Kirky out, boys. Come on, skate to the bench. Let's go. Good. Good change. Right, covering my man. And that's a power play for Bakersfield. Brilliant job, guys. So, I've got to kill a killer penalty. Let's give it a go. Just get one. I'll try my best, coach. I'll try not to make any uh, penalties. Okay, I did get that puck. Can you, can you stop hitting me off the puck, please? I'd really appreciate it. Okay. Okay, good. That's good. some decent penalty killing from me there to start, though. Okay, I'm covering my man. You are my man to cover. You are my man to cover. Excuse me. You are my man to cover. Up, oh, up. Good save. Good save by Langhammer. Oh, no. Oh, good. Clear that puck. Send it down. Good clear. Taking a line change. There you go. Managed to get the puck down the ice. Defense and team play are going to go up if I keep doing that on the penalty kill. So let's see if we can kill that penalty. I've got a little bit more time on the penalty kill to kill off. How much longer we got? Uh, 42 seconds. 40 seconds, basically. Okay, 40 seconds. Assume this is my man to cover. Oh, good. Covering for the defense. Getting better at defensive awareness stats. Just covering my man. That's all I've got to do. All I've got to do is cover my man. Oh, okay, and it gets flicked in. I better not get bad line defense. Because that was nothing to do with me. I was covering my man. Okay, yeah, I didn't get anything against me. So it's a 3 nothing lead for the Bakersfield Condors. Managed to get a bit of a glitchy goal there, but what can you do? Right, get me on the ice, coach, on even strength. I will try my best to score. Okay, let's go. Good, good. Okay, to me. Round the back of the net I go. Or do I? Or do I? Or do I? Over. There you go. What a beautiful assist for Liam Kirk. First AHL point for the British Phenom. What a lovely cross-crease pass. Went through three different Condors players. That was gorgeous. Look at that. You are welcome for that goal, son. I want to have another look at this. That was lovely from Laurent Dauphin. First goal of the season. Look, which way do I go? Find him open. Three different Condors players that went through. I threaded that needle. Beautiful job there, Liam Kirk, getting his first point. You see, you get me on the ice. Get me on the ice at even strength. And I'll work something out for you. Don't you worry. Good poke check by Kirk to put it into the offensive zone. Oh, I wanted to try and get the hit there. Okay, my player's being blocked by one of their... Surely that's interference game. Oh, I don't know. I think it is, but what do I know? Careful defense. Careful defense. Careful defense. Right, we've got the puck. Good. Let's break out. Good pass, bud. Good pass. Okay, shot. Oh, screenshot. That almost actually went somewhere. Okay, I tried to call for the pass. It should have been passed to me, but turns out it wasn't. Okay, skating on side. Right, skate to the bench. You got it, coach. I don't want to annoy the coach with my line changes. B minus, C plus, C plus. So you get an assist. We're within two now. I think we can get this, boys. I think if we get another quick one on my next shift, we're back in this game. Oh, and a power play. Perfect. Let's do this, Roadrunners. Liam Kirk, let's get this on the power play. I'm going to crash this face off. Straight into the face off just in case it's tied up. Let's go. 
to the fight. Okay, good win. Good win, gents. Okay, I'm going to go to the other side. To me. Good. To you. Good. Good. Oh, good shot there. Good shot. So, one minute 50 left on the power play. Ryan Hamilton, one goal away from a hat-trick in this game. That's lovely. Let's carry on. <laughs> I don't care. All right, let's try and camp out in front of the net, I think. Try and get a redirection. Okay. Camp out in front of the net. Okay, nope. Looks like it's going to be cleared. It's going to be cleared. Okay, no worries. Let's just camp out near the blue line. Camp out near the blue line. Okay, to me. Okay, I tried the pass there. Okay, you got it. Good. Okay, who, who's got the puck? You've got... Ugh. Boys, we've got to be able to exit the zone. Like, come on, gents. To you. You got some speed. Good. 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 Oh, good try there, gents. Good blocked pass. Uh, try to pr try to poke check. That could have been a tripping penalty. I'm glad that it wasn't. All right, come on, gents. Who's got the puck? Okay, to me. Good pass off the boards. Okay. Low pad rebound. Ah, oh, shoot for it, son. Bloody Ethan Bear getting in the way. I thought that was a good opportunity there, boys. To me. Good. Beat that offside. Oh, careful. Good. He's finding his way through. Shot. Oh, and that's a glove save by the goaltender. Flashing that glove. Bakersfield Condors upcoming games. Really don't care. I'm not on the Bakersfield Condors. B for offense. C plus for defense. C plus for team play. So a much better game here for Liam Kirk in his third game in the AHL. He's finding his feet now. Right, let's get me back on, get me back on the ice. It's a little bit late for the power play to be working. Good pass, though. Beautiful. Okay, circle back round. Circle back round. Back to the defense. Oh, that's a good one-timer attempt. Oh, good try there, boys. Try and get the hit in there. Good play. Good play. Good. Good shot. Oh, how was that a weak shot? Minus 48 experience for that shot. It was a low-pad rebound. It worked really well. Wow, game. You're cruel. Okay, Ethan Bear. Ethan Bear, I'm covering you, man. Oh, no, now I've got to cover him. Which one am I supposed to cover? Make a choice, game. All right, good pass. Over to you. Oh, no, get that. Get that. Oh, come on, dude. I made that so easy for you to pick up. Okay, th this is the man that I'm covering. Good play to me. Good pass. Okay. Just carefully through the zone. Good to you. Ah. Oh, needed that a little bit lower. We could have may maybe have got a rebound from that. So, 737 left in the third. B, C, plus, C, plus. I'm doing all right here so far, though. I'm quite happy. 436. I'd love to get a goal in this game. That would cap off this game perfectly. Well, except from the fact that we're losing. But I didn't really expect much different, to be fair. You've got to get that puck out, son. You've got to get that puck out. Good save by Langhammer. Okay, tried to call for the pass, but I'm actually quite glad it didn't work out. Right, come on, Kirky. Let's get ourselves a goal. You deserve it, son. You deserve it. Okay, take that puck away. Good hit. You've got to try and pass that puck, gents. Oh, come on. Defensive recovery. So that's good. Are they actually going to try and get the puck out the zone? Or are we just going to let them sit there on the forecheck for ages? Oh, look. They're forechecking again. Even though the puck should have got out of the zone. Ah, oh, this is fun. Oh, come on, fellas. Seriously? Oh, this is just disappointing. Right, good. To me. Thank you. Right, uh, drop pass. That's a great drop pass. Oh, and a glove save. That was a lovely pass by Kirk, though. Dropping that pass back. Okay, we're out, out for the face-off again. Okay. Gonna try and get some space on the other side of the net. Depends how the face-off goes. Okay, they win the face-off. Jason Garrison down with the Bakersfield Condors. Of course, they're the Edmonton Oilers AHL affiliate. I think I saw Chris Russell down there as well. Good pass. That's a breakout pass from Liam Kirk right there. To me, to me, nice. Ah, oh, shot gets blocked in front. Right, skate to the bench. We might get one more shift in this game. We've had a pretty good showing, I think, though. B, B minus on defense now and C, and C plus on team play. I think the coach is going to be happy with us in this game. I think he's going to be really happy with what we've done. 39 seconds left in the game. Please don't empty the net because I don't want another minus. Please don't empty the net. Please don't empty the net. Okay, careful, fellas. Somebody go and get it. Okay, no, you're, you're, okay, who am I covering? I'm covering this one then. Covering this one. Covering this one. Good, good play. To me, oh, what a pass. What a pass. Over. Ah, oh, tried to pass that puck. Good poke check. Good takeaway, son. Good. Oh, and I get completely knocked over. All right, okay. I did pass that puck, but all right then. Good play. To me. Back to you. 
Good setup pass. Oh, off the post. Off the post. Get it in. Somebody whack it in. Ah, oh, and as the game ends, it's a 3-1 victory for the Bakersfield Condors. However, Liam Kirk had a much better game there, managing to grab his first AHL point and his first AHL assist. He played well defensively on the puck as well. B, B minus and C plus. I'm quite pleased with that. No penalties taken either. So, minus 34 on shooting because the wrist shot power. I think that's really poor. Puck skills improved with the passing. Senses, skating. Physical, we lost 10% for the durability. And 96 for defense. So, we're getting some experience here. We're losing some experience in places as well. But I, th I think we're doing a pretty good job here, guys. Game three of the AHL season. We're starting to find our form here. We're starting to find some consistency. Starting to put some points on the board. Which is what we want at the end of the day. We're a playmaker. We need to make plays. So, game number four is against the Rockford Ice Hogs. So, let's take a look at how this goes. 749 experience. In-game performance, 408 experience we have gained this last week. That's pretty good. I'm quite happy with that. Dave Boland currently leading the team two points in three games. I'm only one point away from the tied team leads. That's good. So, game number four will simulate period by period against the Rockford Ice Hogs. Here we go. Cousins against Knott for the opening face-off in Tuscan. First period. Okay, it's a one nothing game. Nick Cousins scores on Anton Forsberg. Ten shots to three in favour of Tuscan. Second period. Okay, it's a 1-1 game. Cahoon scores on Hill. 18 shots to 15 in favour of Tuscan. And third period. No, no score at the end of the third period. 31 shots, though, to 20 in favour of Tuscan. Overtime. And it looks like Tuscan scored in overtime. Dave Boland scored on Anton Forsberg. Let's take a look to see if we got any points in the game. We didn't get any goals, I know that much. Uh, Liam Kirk, nope, one shot in the game, and that was about it. Okay, so we're not exactly having the best time through the simulation. We are only 68 overall. So, now we have another game against Rockford the next day in Tuscan. So, it's two back-to-back -back games in Tuscan. So, the final game of the episode. Here we go, Kirky. Let's do this. We're 2-2-0 to start the season. Richardson against Louis to start the game in the face-off circle, I should say. Face-off dot, face-off circle. What does it matter? First period. Okay, it is a one nothing lead. Henrik Samuelsson scores on Langhammer. 14 shots to 9 in favour of Rockford. Second period. Okay, it's a 2-1 game. Boland scores and Ia Capelli scores on Langhammer. 24 shots to 15 in favour of Rockford. Although it's only a one goal lead for the Ice Hogs. Worse offence, equal defence, worse goaltending. Come on, Kirky. We need to get our first goal. Let's, let's end this episode... With a solid first goal in the AHL. Would be having two points in five games. Although two points in three periods we've simulated. I would be very, very happy with that. I must admit. It's got to find our form. Of course, we're playing a completely different country. Completely different league. Completely different standard of players. We need to step it up here. C plus, C plus, C plus for each of our stats. As the puck is dropped for the third period. We'll probably get brought into the game about 90 seconds in. I wouldn't be surprised. So, yep, 90 seconds in. Here we go. Come on, Tuscan. Come on, Kirky. Let's win the game. Okay, get me out. Good, good. Let's go, boys. Okay, that was an interesting pass attempt. Hit him. I, I'm really annoyed that I can't actually make, like, proper body checks. I know it's because he's 68 overall and he's not exactly known as a hitter anyway. But it just really irritates me, you know. Right, I'm covering my man quite nicely. I think I'm covering him quite nicely. Oh, good shot attempt there by the Rockford Ice Hogs. Okay, boys, what's going on? Is that a trip? Yep, we're on the penalty kill. Well done, Roadrunners. You really know how to keep yourselves in this game, don't you? So, 17.56 left in the game. It's a penalty kill. Are they going to ask me to come out on the penalty kill? Yes, they are. About 30 seconds after the penalty was made. Okay, coach, get me out there. Do my best. Okay, Louis. Louis. No, you're not getting that puck. Right, careful. This is the man I need to cover. This is the man I need to cover. Okay, that was it. Very, very far wide. Okay, good. Clear that puck down the ice. Good job, Liam Kirk. Just Sometimes you've just got to slap shot, slap shot it down the ice, you know. Tuola. Okay, I was going to hit him properly. For some reason, the game didn't want me to. So, thanks, game. Okay, left winger, cover your man. Cover your man. So, what you got to do? Cover your man. Good play. Good play, Liam Kirk. He's going through the zone. Here he comes. Here he comes. Ah, uh, low pad rebound. Ah, oh, could have tried to. I mean, I lost a bit there, and then I got bits first shot for a rebound. Hey, 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 captain of the Ice Hogs. Let's let's chill out here, man. We're cool. C plus in all of my stats still, but I'm, I'm making some good things happen. Clearing that puck on the penalty kill. Actually generating some offense on the penalty kill as well, which is important. 
You don't just have to sit back and play defense when you're on the penalty kill. Okay, let's go. To me. Oh, come on. That was a great pass. Good interception. Good to Kirky. Kirky with the puck. Right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, get out the way. Oh, one of my players was in the way of my short side snipe attempt. Oh, why would you do that? Oh, I tried to set you guys up. You can't even help me out. Oh, come on, Roadrunners teammates. You're not really helping me out here. Good slap shot attempt, although it was blocked. Careful, fellas. To me. Oh, come on. Get this puck. Get this puck. Good. Okay. Over to you. That's a great pass. It's a great pass on the setup. Oh, good attempt there, boy. Okay, try to cover for him. Okay, trying to make hits here. I don't even know why I'm trying to make hits. I know they're not going to work. Is that another Is that another penalty? No? Are we good? Uh, okay, I think we're good. I'll skate to the bench after this shift, coach. Coach, I will come back, I promise. But I just want to do this first. To you. Right, okay. Okay, I need to go for a line change. Go for a line change. Archibald. Oh, almost scores. I might have got an assist on that if he scored on that. So, C plus, C plus, C plus still. We're doing all right here. I either need to get the puck to somebody out in front of the net, or I just need to score a goal. Okay, 8.24. Wow, I had a long shift out. But we're on the power play, so I have the chance to make something happen here. 43 seconds left of power play time. We need to tie up this game. Let's make it happen. Okay, they're going to clear the puck down the ice by the looks of it. Oh, and that's a 5 on 3. Thank you very much. Oh, get me out on the ice for a 5 on 3. I can score on one of them. Coach, come on. Oh, coach. That's unfair, coach. And you know it. Get me out on the ice. Good. Okay, 30 seconds. Left of the of the power play time. Okay, circle back round. Circle back round. Oh, okay. All three players decided to crash in on me, which I think is a little bit unfair. I, if I'd passed that puck out, we would have had so many players open. There was just no room to make a decision there. Okay, good. To me. Good. Oh, of course it's blocked. Of course every shot I take is blocked. Right, come on, boys. Come on, Kirky. Right, to me. To pass. Pass the puck, dude. Can only stay on side for so long. Okay. Over. Oh, come on. Make the pass, bud. Here you go. Oh, good shot attempt there. Could have been another assist for Kirk there. I don't care about the Ice Hogs upcoming schedule. Do I play for them game? No, I don't care. <laughs> get out of my face. Right, three minutes, ten left in the game. Come on, we need to at least get the game tying goal. Come on, Kirk. You need to do something here, son. You've got one point in the AHL so far. It's not good enough at the moment. Okay, careful. Oh, no. No. Good. Stop. Get this puck out. Good. To me. Okay. Let's find some space here. Find some space. No. Oi! You didn't take that off me. Oh, game. I hate it when it does that. Okay, careful. Careful. Right. Work on the four check, gents. Work on the four check. Good play. Good play. Oh, I'm, try I'm trying to find somewhere to get open to. Okay, to me. Good play. Okay, I tried to pass that puck over. Didn't quite work by the looks of it. Oh, why did I send that puck round? What am I doing? Okay. I kind of wanted to try and get that to me. Okay, good. Oh, come on. Another opportunity just goes wide. Oh, why Why would you make that awful pass? Right, okay. I'm, I'm losing it here now, guys. I think that's the last shift. And that, that's just a poor end to the game for me. Just n have no idea what I'm playing at there. So, as the period comes to an end, it is a 2-1 victory for Rockford. Liam Kirk really didn't do much in that game, unfortunately. That's partially due to me and partially due to my teammates just not helping me out. So, C+, C+, and C+, for the game. Which is good in some ways. However, we didn't really gain much experience from that game. We didn't really do anything. That's the problem. Every shot I tried to take was blocked. Every pass I tried to make was almost intercepted 90% of the time. Ah, it's a bit disappointing there for the first episode of the season uh, for Liam Kirk. However, we'll simulate to the next game, see if any changes get made. We're against the Ontario Reign for the next episode. Uh, we're going to make some changes. Hudson Fashing has been injured. That's a shame. Uh, so, what's happening now? So, we've gained another 500 experience, 72 in-game performance experience. That isn't really a huge amount. We're not really getting a huge amount of experience here, so... The Ontario Reign is our next opponent to start next episode. But I am going to end this episode here, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you have enjoyed. Please feel free to like, subscribe, share, or watch some of my other videos. Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye.